Of Denise's memorial, there were a number of very special announcements today. Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland is live now also at the Convention Center with that part of our coverage tonight. Matt? Well, Dennis, you said it. Denise probably wouldn't like all this attention, but it was definitely deserving. Honoring a lady who meant so much to the station, its viewers, and the state. Denise DeCenzo helped pave the way in making Channel 3 the new station of choice for so many in Connecticut. And soon the road leading up to the job she called home for so many years will forever sport her name. This spring, we have a new address, so when you come to look for us, ask your GPS to find us at 3 Denise DeCenzo Way, Rocky Hill, Connecticut. A simple way to honor her life and her legacy. So just note that it's not a road or a street, it's a way. That's a nod to Denise for us. The way she lived, the way she was. Just like her motto, to be open, to be brave, and to be kind. To help fulfill that, her family is starting the Denise Foundation with a mission to support Denise's passions and causes near and dear to her heart. Your donation will go to a myriad of causes from women's health to children to education. The list goes on. It's going to be an amazing organization that will carry out Denise's legacy of kindness through fun events. To top it off, Governor Ned Lamont declared tomorrow, January 30th, 2019, Denise's birthday as Denise DeCenzo Day here in Connecticut. There's not much I can do without going through the legislature, but um, one thing I can do is uh, announce with great certainty that uh, tomorrow is uh, named after your mom. Tomorrow is your wife's day. And uh, we only celebrate three birthdays. So we got George Washington, we got Martin Luther King, and now we have Double D Day. Now, over the years, Denise put together countless stories, introducing us to people, sharing their journeys, and highlighting them along the way. A number of them were at today's memorial service, and we'll hear from them coming up tonight at 6. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom in Hartford. Matt McFarland, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.